The first successful use of the combat drone, Lancet, at a record distance of 101 kilometers, was officially announced by the Russian group of companies Zala, a well-known developer and manufacturer of unmanned aerial vehicles from Ishevsk, on August 4, 2025. This loitering munition struck an adversary radar station that was situated at a considerable distance from the Lancet family's previous operational range during a special military operation. Before that time, the maximum combat range of these drones had not exceeded approximately 70 kilometers. The operational reach of the Russian military in the conflict zone is significantly increased as a result of this breakthrough, which represents a substantial increase in the capabilities of Russia's UAVs from 2024 to 2025. The Lancet family of drones is a highly effective method for destroying adversary artillery radars, communication nodes, and radar systems and is actively employed on the front line. These kamikaze drones are highly accurate and capable of delivering a variety of payloads, including high explosive and shaped charges. Additionally, developers have observed that Lancets can counter adversary strike UAVs, making them multifunctional assets in contemporary warfare. In addition to the extended combat range of the Lancets, developers have also substantially improved the technical characteristics of other UAV models from the Zala group. For example, the reconnaissance drone Zala Z-16, which is used to monitor attacks by Lancets, is capable of operating at distances exceeding 100 kilometers in 2025. The drone will return to its base after completing its surveillance mission. This improvement is made possible by new communication systems that ensure steady video and data transmission, even when there is strong electronic interference from the enemy. Zala Aero Group started developing and producing UAVs many years ago. The Lancet family, which comprises at least three variants with warhead weights of 1 kilogram, 3 kilograms, and 5 kilograms, has demonstrated its effectiveness in actual combat scenarios. Initially deployed in Syria in 2021, the drones have been integral to the special military operation in Ukraine since 2022. Item 53, the heavier Lancet variant, is capable of being launched from container units mounted on mobile platforms. Such capability allows for the implementation of swarm tactics for intricate adversary engagements. Additionally, it features folding wings. The Lancets have experienced a more than threefold increase in serial production in Ishevsk in recent years, which is indicative of the increasing demand and significance of the product. The Lancets are equipped with electric motors for acoustic and thermal stealth, as well as optoelectronic and television guidance systems that enable the operator to precisely control the munition during the final flight phases. The unique aspect is that the guidance modules can be swapped out for different tasks, and there are many types of sensors available, like infrared cameras, laser designators, gas analyzers, and radiometers. Lancet is designed to resist electronic warfare by not relying on satellite navigation and being equipped with laser weapon protection. Lancet is one of the most viable assault systems, capable of deep penetration into enemy territory, the destruction of critical targets, and the infliction of significant damage on air defense and communication systems due to its increased operational range. The use of Lancets to strike high-tech targets, such as MiG-29 fighter aircraft, at distances exceeding 80 kilometers, serves as evidence of their capability, as these ranges were previously unattainable for such unmanned aerial vehicles. Lancet is acknowledged by Western defense analysts as a combat drone system that has had a substantial impact on the Ukraine conflict and is both effective and noteworthy. It is commended for its precision strike capability against high-value targets, including Western-supplied artillery, radar units, and air defense systems. It is a valuable asset for both conventional and asymmetric warfare due to its relatively low cost, modular design, and simplicity of deployment. Western sources acknowledge the drone's endurance and strike range. 
the typical operational range of the drone is approximately 40 to 70 kilometers. Western observers emphasize that the Lancet system incorporates real-time video transmission and sophisticated electro-optical guidance, which enables operators to identify and engage targets with high precision. The drone has been observed to operate in conjunction with Russian reconnaissance UAVs for target acquisition and damage assessment, thereby illustrating the implementation of integrated battlefield tactics. Nevertheless, Western analysis also emphasizes the Lancet drone's substantial dependence on Western commercial components. Security institutions' investigations have disclosed that critical components, including AI processors from NVIDIA, GPS navigation modules with anti-jamming capabilities from Swiss and Czech manufacturers, and other communication components, are procured from Western countries or their commercial markets. The Lancet's autonomous targeting and electronic warfare resilience are improved by this reliance on foreign technology. However, Russia is also vulnerable to supply chain vulnerabilities as a result of export controls. In conclusion, the Lancet UAV's record combat range of 101 kilometers represents an important step forward in Russian unmanned weapon systems significantly increasing the Russian armed forces' capabilities in modern combat operations by delivering high precision and effective strikes at significant distances from their launch points. This progress clearly shows the strategic significance of the Lancet systems in Russia's armament, along with the significant technical advancements. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, please take our channel membership, which is very affordable, to encourage us.